a quick presentation on scanning to M file using eCopy Share Scan. M files is a leading uh, document management system. Uh, it has a cloud version and it has on premise version. Uh, M file allows you to uh, scan and store documents and also has some workflow component. With eCopy Share Scan, you, we can allow you to scan documents from the MFD and store directly into M files with all the metadata provided. This connector is a third party connector uh, which is available from Connectix. So this is uh, not a nuance connector but a third party connector that we can purchase from Connectix. M file, the, I'm using an M file demo uh, system which is a hosted system. I have a sample vault on there. This is a live system uh, but using demo data set. So these are different class and different uh, document types that I have in my repository and I want to scan from my SharePoint to these. As with uh, all other connectors that we have for eCopy Share Scan, there are multiple profiles that you can create uh, to scan. I have created one profile which allows me to scan to all the classes that are available and uh, I will show you another workflow in which I have a dedicated class which is so class is like a a type of document in M files uh, so in, in this case you know if you want to scan purchase invoice that's a class of document employment agreement is a class of document so that is how M file works in in terms of classification of document so let's say I want to scan a project plan into M file uh, I can choose the class project plan it wants me to give a name to the plan so let's say I have got a signed SOW for a project that I am working on and the project uh, that we are working is so the name or title was a free field I type whatever I needed and the project is an existing project in my M files repository so when I start typing it picks up the different projects which are uh, available so I choose the website graphics for ESTT that's my customer and the project and I send the document in as you always know that we can disable preview if required or we can leave the preview as it is uh, so the document uh, is gone into M files uh, there's a couple of ways that I can see the document I can quickly go to recently accessed by me because this is scanned by me so it will show me uh, in my recent access document so this is the signed SOW I can see I can see the metadata of the document so this is a project plan for this project if required I could have these keywords and description field available on my MFD and I can fill up from there or I can update from here uh, another way to find the document and this is an M file feature but I'm just trying to show how we can based on whatever parameters we provided on the share scan we were able to now get the document into the correct place so if I go into my documents and and search for the document by class uh, this is a project document so there's a different couple of different ways we could have done this uh, project plan so I can see this project plan here or the other way to find this document have could have been uh, I can find for all documents by project it will ask me which project you want to choose this is the website graphics for ESTT and the sign SOW document is there with the metadata and you can preview this is this is all m file features so i'm not going to talk more about it uh, but what we can do with ecopy is you know i can choose which class i want to scan to or if there is some documents that i scan all the time like contracts and agreement in this case i don't have to choose the class this is already dedicated to the class and when i scan to this the class selection will not come automatically the metadata field is come so now the agreement title is updated agreement and this is free field agreement type this is an existing uh, so type of agreement that has uh, so this is a reseller agreement you pick the customer and again we can Warwick system technology description is a free field it's non-mandatory field so I can skip it uh, the date that the 
agreement was signed I can give this the owner of the agreement I can again this is a lookup field I can start typing and it will look for it and the document can be sent again you can go back to M file and search for your document in various different ways that I showed you one quick uh, show into how the uh, connector is set up uh, there's as I said you can have a couple of different profiles as required you specify the URL of your uh, M file servers give the credentials